It is an absolute gem for Major League Soccer. Livestrong Sporting Park, Sporting KC and Toronto FC tonight on by Adidas. Adidas is all in, and for Paul Mariner, Freddie Hall, his third MLS game start. Darren O'D just his fourth. Ryan Johnson, game start appearance, and Kai Kamara, 130th game start. And this is, as we mentioned, 28. Be excited. Fan base here in Kansas City with the U.S. Open Cup already celebrated with their victory over San Jose and a championship chase is now clearly on. Toronto FC and the Reds attacking from right to left to start us off and in their familiar home like the following names drafted. Chance Myers first, Roger Espinosa 11th, Matt Beasler 8th, Graham Zussi 23rd, Teal Bunbury 10th, CJ Sapong. And the list goes on as does the Kansas City attack and Hall goes up. And it's headed off the mark, Kai Kamara. Now, Kai Kamara can hurt in so many different ways, and when Hall comes, he needs to really command his box again. Bowling by Myers, driven, we call that. Hell coming, but cannot get there. It's important again for players to jump with. Pioneers will seems will be successful against that central duo of Beesler and Ola. Handball, but advantage call by the referee, and rightfully so. Kansas City really using their width, and Kamara again cut off before he could get to that ball. In Toronto, does push forward. It's a very different look without the big man up top. CJ Sapong takes on OD. The doubleiner stays with him. The drop for Myers. Ball just keeps moving, doesn't stay on anyone's foot for too long in Kansas City. Espinoza! That's why they're happy he didn't go anywhere. He's in the final year of his contract, so MLS fans enjoy him perhaps all you can. He's a free agent at the end of the year, and many expect he'll move on somewhere. Very good interplay by Myers and Sapong. Eckersley trying to clear it up. Ball done. Perhaps play second half minutes if it's deemed by Paul Mariner to be an area they have to improve upon. But Kai Kamara can beat you so many ways, and he's on the ball again. Sapong in the box off a deflection. Sapong laid off. A lot of room now, top of the box. Espinosa, why not, with another crack, and it's Hall. Vacuums that one up at the six. You don't have to hit me with your best shot. Yeah, just, you know, lover boys, Jeremy. Memory lane for the old folks of here. First concert for this man carrying the ball was the Killers. Back in his hometown, here's Ryan Johnson looking to kill this one, and he does! Toronto FC strike first. Lovely feed from Eckersley finds Johnson. And in the 44th minute, Ryan Johnson connects with his sixth goal of the season. Great build-up starts in midfield. Again, if you can possess the ball, look at Eckersley stepping and then finding that great diagonal ball to Mr. Johnson into out. Chance Myers caught asleep. And that's all it takes. As Pet Benatar said, hit me with your best shot. And that's what Ryan Johnson did. one nothing Toronto FC. And what a good time then just before half. Kamar with the turn, but you can see he threw three red jerseys into the lane where he wanted to take the shot. So it's laid off. Spinoza with the lead. I think he tried to get to that one, but slipped on the turf. This is the end of the turf that was not covered by the whiteboards in that concert held here last night. Here's a kind of casual play, if you will, by Emery, and that gave the fans a little bit of hope. Yeah. Three-man wall, and it's free kick taken by Zussi. Back post, and boy, Kai Kamara was there, just couldn't get to it. There's a volley shot, and it bounces over top of Hall, and we're tied at one. That's so unfortunate to deal well with the first cross. Jeremy Hall gets a piece of the ball, but then Nagamura, who wants to strike a goal, as he hits the turf and then goes over. The goalkeeper, the AGC ball gets swing done, swing in. Very good defending there by Aaron Mon and by Jeremy Hall. And then Nakamura actually hits the ground and surprises a flat-footed. Being tracked by Darren O'Dee. 
Back post. BFC able to clear that one, but not out of harm's way just yet. Nagamora. Zussi, back post. Good run on here, and it's Hall that gets it. A second chance to keep it out. Boy, Zussi and Davis, you watch these two guys between Houston and Kansas City. They just know where to put the ball. Uh, they really do, and Zussi again on his favorite right foot. Tom's along, and people are losing track of their runners in the back post. And let's be real honest. Espinosa closing down Dunfield, but Ottawa FC in tight space here. Some nice work. All keeps the play moving. Dunfield calls for it. Back to Wiedemann. Looking to cross it in. Able to, top of the box. Silva knocks it down. He's got her shot, and it's parried away. Nielsen with a big save on a blast by the Toronto rookie. Right back in. No, it's knocked across the end. Touch line for a corner kick. What a moment by Luis Silva, and that man comes up with a gem of a save. Great sequence of ball possession and movement. Terry Dunfield, Wiedemann on that left foot, gets the ball, and Silva again just gets an extension, hits it, and <laughs> that's the only save he's made in a good one. Under the category of best names in sport, that's probably why you wanted Sunni Saad into the match. Don Dwyer wears number 14 for Peter Vermees as he makes his professional debut in a 1-1 tie in the 87th minute. Kamara so far has been held off the score sheet. This man has not. Nagamura. Myers. There's a touch and it gets past Hall. And the look of disbelief is on the face of everyone in red right now. Just gut-wrenching, you know, the patient build-up, the moving of players, finally finding the open men, and then the ball being played back in. You know what, Mr. Hall, you got to do better there. It's as simple as that. Pointed to the turf right after the goal, but he knows. Some guys late make the same mistakes, and that will and need to change. It's also a team that hasn't had a substitution the entire match. So, as opposed to Kansas City, have used three of theirs. It's also a team playing without a number of starters. So, here's another chance, maybe to get a tying goal. Wide open goal. Here's the shot, and it's just wide of the post. I don't know. You come to Kansas City and play this team and get four scoring chances legit in a game. Jimmy Nielsen gets up knowing he's lucky again. Good defending by Myers there, though. Silva just finds just good, good position. A TFC win. Yes, out chance, but every chance that they've had on goal has been a legitimate scoring chance. And that'll do it. Referee blows it down, and a heartbreak again for Toronto FC. As Peter Vermees and Paul Mariner, a lot of respect between those.